In Sherry slash The Last of Sherry, Colette delves into the complexities of love, desire, and the passage of time through the characters of Leah and Sherry. Set in the vibrant backdrop of early 20th century Paris, the novella explores the aftermath of a passionate affair between the young, charming Sherry and the older, experienced Leah. Central to the narrative is the exploration of love as both a liberating and confining force. Sherry, despite his youthful exuberance and carefree demeanor, finds himself deeply entangled in emotions he struggles to comprehend. Leah, on the other hand, embodies a woman who has lived and loved intensely, yet remains composed and self-assured. Their affair, spanning six years, is marked by a profound emotional connection that transcends their age difference and societal expectations. Colette portrays love not merely as a romantic ideal but as a force that shapes identities and challenges conventions. Through Sherry's character development, we witness the transformation from a boyish charm to a man burdened by introspection and longing. His initial carefree attitude gradually gives way to a sense of disillusionment as he grapples with the realization of his deep emotional dependence on Leah. The novella's exploration of desire is equally nuanced. Colette depicts desire not solely as physical attraction but as a complex interplay of emotions and expectations. Sherry is drawn to Leah not only for her physical beauty but for the emotional fulfillment she provides. Their relationship becomes a sanctuary from the outside world, where societal norms and responsibilities are momentarily suspended. However, as the narrative unfolds, the inevitability of change becomes apparent, and the characters are forced to confront the transient nature of desire and passion. A significant theme in Sherry slash The Last of Sherry is the passage of time and its transformative effect on relationships. Colette vividly captures the bittersweet essence of growing older and the nostalgia for youth and past experiences. Leah and Sherry's affair is shadowed by the awareness of its impermanence, magnifying every moment of joy and sorrow they share. The novella's melancholic undertone underscores the fleeting nature of happiness and the inevitability of loss. Colette's prose is rich with sensory detail, evoking the decadence and allure of Belle Epoque Paris. The vivid descriptions of luxurious settings and elegant lifestyles serve not only as a backdrop but as a reflection of the characters' inner worlds. Through her meticulous portrayal of surroundings and atmosphere, Colette invites readers into a world where beauty and passion coexist with emotional turmoil and uncertainty. Sherry slash The Last of Sherry concludes with a poignant reflection on the nature of love and human relationships. As Sherry and Leah navigate their separate paths, the novella leaves readers with a sense of longing and introspection. Colette's exploration of love, desire, and the passage of time resonates beyond the confines of the narrative, inviting readers to contemplate the complexities of the human heart and the enduring impact of fleeting moments of intimacy. In essence, Sherry slash The Last of Sherry is a masterful exploration of love and longing, rendered with lyrical prose and profound insight. Colette's portrayal of Leah and Sherry's relationship transcends its historical context, offering a timeless meditation on the fragility of human emotions and the inexorable passage of time.